Hola. Hello. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you. I'm nice Kirsten. to meet you, Isabella. Hi. Okay. Thank Hello. you. We saw the roof already. Yeah, really. It's really cool. Yeah. The house was called like a circus. I don't know how to say it. the the thing that you put like up in the circus. Like a circus tent? Yeah, like a circus tent. Yeah. They, they... It was known as the circus house here in the... Yeah. So all the neighbors called it the circus tent. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. But it's very interesting shape. The shape of the house is like, right, it's right. great. It's like, there's no, no corners, like proper corners, like all sort of octagon, hexagonals and stuff. Yeah. You want to come in? Sure. <laughs> sure. Now I'm curious about the shape. <laughs> in. Oh, wow. Welcome. Thank you. You can kind of get lost in the curves here, right? It's like a walk. It's, it's like a walk. So what, what is the shape of this house? Have you figured it out? You can't even say it's a hexagon or a like... It, yeah. I, there's a lot of hexagons. Yeah, yeah the hexagons, octagons. It's almost like a fractal type of... Yeah. Thing. Right? True. true. But true. True. isn't it interesting that someone did like a house like this in, back in the days? Yeah. What I found more interesting about this Catalan architecture is that the modernist is like, it's not obsessive, you know? So it's like a Mediterranean way of doing it. So you can see that it's like there's a touch of modernness, but it's not the same that as you see in other countries. It's a cool living, you know, like easy living. And you know, when, when the people from the original, from the house, they came, they said, oh, we can see a lot of Brazilian uh, icons, you no know, design things in the air like the the hammock and the green and the the yellow and they said okay yeah but we know we didn't ask for any of this kind of so it's cool because yeah, I mean we're from Brazil and yeah. even though we live here for a long time now we use it a lot pretty much every night yeah, we hang yeah. here and have like long shots at because it's a, such a big space that uh, it would be hard for us to fill it with. Right, right. It's like it's better than we have like a sofa or you know it's like super oh, right yeah. because it doesn't block the light either there's nothing that no. what i found that the catalan modern is not obsessed you can feel it as mediterranean inspired so i think it's cool it's more relaxed yeah. effortless yeah. modernness you know it is like it is i don't have to put many objects to feel that is modernness you know Initially, when we saw this house, it was like too big because it's like 400 something square meters. Seven rooms before. Yeah. You know, a lot of walls in between spaces. So. No, nobody would buy a house like this if you don't see a potential. If you don't see like modernism, like a, the potential of, uh, that we saw, pretty much nobody yeah. saw because it was like for six or seven years the, the, the house was like uh, open for sale and nobody, nobody got. <laughs> It was like kind of dark because a lot of doors, you know. But, you know, since we have this passion and this idea of modernism and stuff, we just saw it and we think, well, this could be great. I mean, if we can renovate it properly, it can be like an amazing house, you know. But the whole living area, I think it was where, where we really saw the potential, right? Yeah. I remember me like entering here, say like, oh, this light is beautiful. I don't care what, what we manage to do in the rooms, that, that will turn out like good. I, let, let's see if we can find a good architect. <laughs> Hello. Realmente cuando nosotros llegamos, la sensación era de laberinto. Tú entrabas y te empezabas a pasear y, y, y un poco te perdías. A ver, que estamos aquí, ¿dónde tenéis? Aquí, tío. La idea era tener un laberinto, pero un laberinto abierto. Es decir, que no te perdieses como te perdías antes. Y un poco era esta idea de, de ir creando el bosque, ¿no? Entonces, ¿entramos en el bosque? Sí, entramos en el bosque. Entonces, lo primero, lo primero que vemos es ¿no? esta idea de que tienes un paso para allí, otro para allá y otro para allá. O sea, Tienes libertad para escoger, que esto es, es siempre bueno. Y teniendo el punto de referencia. Claro, ya, ya vas un poco siempre para allá. El tronco. Tronco. <risa> Toda esta zona, lo único que intentamos fue darle un fondo. Hacer un fondo suave que nos va a recoger to toda la casa. Entonces, 
y así entramos por este, este lugar ¿no? de, de bosque y así nos abre el espacio ¿no? y a partir de aquí empiezas a ver el, todo el exterior porque la casa tiene eso, está muy bien orientada y nos va recorriendo todo el, todo el sol. Entonces, un poco, un poco la idea del bosque es, tú en un bosque no te sueles perder, hay, hay diferente densidad de, de espacios. Tú vas caminando y en un lado encuentras un comedor, en un lado encuentras la sala, un, la hamaca, pero no es que sean un comedor, una habitación, un tal, sino que simplemente fluyes por los lugares y te encuentras los, los muebles o, la, o las actividades. Y esta pieza, en, en especial esta pieza es verde y tiene, tiene una textura diferente para que te haga de punto de referencia, para que tú sepas dónde estás, ¿no? Estás verde, pero el resto es como que te rodea el blanco. Claro, como aquello, el gran árbol, el gran árbol este sí. que, que me orienta dentro de un bosque. Pierdes esa idea del laberinto para esto, para tener la referencia. Bueno, y a la vez aprovechamos estas geometrías para esconder cosas. O sea, todo esto lo aprovechamos dentro de un muro de carga también. Está la estructura y va escondiéndote estas piezas. So, these are I mean, there's some doors that go to the laundry and this is pantry. That's a lot of space. Yeah, but, but actually so, some doors are like a s oh, places. Oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah. And there's like a Yeah, that's like the laundry. Just go to the laundry. Yeah. Here's like some cabinets. There is a little bathroom. The other one goes to the garage. So it's a mix between Uh, cabinets and, and places, let's say. So it's yeah, the cool. whole service area is hidden, you know? So, uh, yeah. but that's like all And we love the wood, idea. I mean, yeah. it's super cozy. Here at the, the, this island, I mean, everything. He, here's what, it, what we mentioned, it was like full of doors, a lot of rooms. Yeah. It was super weird. The kitchen was there, but like a, a wall here, room, 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 room. And what we love is about the lamp, the lighting that is on the walls now. So, it, I mean, there's no lamps on the ceiling beside of the yeah. this one. Yeah. So it's super cool. I mean, it's super cozy at night, you know. So now you're inside another hexagon or something? True. Sort of yeah, I think so. You can see by the ceiling, right? Yeah, yeah. So uh, there is just to, to hide all the refrigerator. That's yeah. like a, a freezer, freezer. Yeah, yeah, refrigerator, oh, wow. freezer, yeah. yeah. So this is, is a, like a um, wardrobe. So you have refrigerator and then just shelving. Yeah, and I mean, we have like, like yeah. electric, you know, yeah. things. Oh, wow. yeah. <laughs> so it's very cool. And here we have the wash machine oh, yeah. and the dishwasher, you know. So this is cool. They, they maintain it, the, the colors, you know. And what is interesting is because we removed a lot of doors here, but we have this still the same doors and then walls as well. Right? And we have the same same floor. So, do you see where the doors or walls? Were? No, actually, it was a very good no, work on here. The, you can the see something. Yeah. Okay. So they so removed was... the old ones, and yeah. you can see you have like some broken pieces yeah. here and there because they had the work of re like it's a so different. bunch of but, walls. Yeah. But basically, there was a wall here. I mean, this was a room, a closed room. This one, no, the kitchen, no, the kitchen was here, just yeah. this part. It okay. was a small kitchen. But a wall? Yeah, a yeah. wall there, a wall here, a wall there. I think there, it was, there. I know, this wall we made no, it, was there. it was tile, yeah. yeah. You know, here they did like a half and a half, you know. So it's nice, I mean, it's history. I think from here you see how this is almost shaped like a puzzle pieces or something, sure. right? Like it's, yeah, they sort of connect, but not Direct, there's nothing, there's no straight lines of connection. Correct, correct. When they named the house Casa Pangram, it's, it's, it's just spot on because it's like you can, you can put pieces together and we can have like a very long views to, to outside, even to the interior. Like when they presented the house to us, they said, ah, open your mind because like, pretty much because of there the, was the, no the, doors. No doors yeah. We were like, okay. No. <laughs> What is a Tangram? Puzzle. I think it's Chinese or we actually have them. Our kid has a, has a sort of like a puzzle. I have one with one. Yeah, I can show you later. Yeah. This floor also is very elegant. That's the original. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we like it because it's kind of a weird color. It looks like a purple. And there are like some tiles that like there are different colors. It's not because, perfect. Yeah. You know, there's like a marks of that living. Gives you a bit of yeah, of course. It's like a purple floor, if you think about it. It's like a, it's very nice, very nice. So we, we, we actually removed the... Like this oh, thing, yeah. is it the trim? The, how do you say, like, a sockle in English, uh, the skirt. I don't understand why the thing was so important. Normally it's to hide the imperfections of the, the floor. 
But actually, one of the things that we, we had in favor on this house is like good sort of a finishings. See here, like they cut all the tiles like properly. There's like not a lot of defects around. So yeah, let's remove it. And actually, I think it looks much better. I wonder if qualities have gone down. <laughs> oh, of course. You wonder. <laughs> <laughs> Don't wonder anymore, huh? <laughs> so here was where the rooms started, you know? This is actually like a, one of the original, that one of the two original rooms that we kept. We just made it like a TV room because uh, we didn't want to put like TV on the living and stuff. Yeah, so here we, we kept it simple as well. I mean, it's super simple. There was a bathtub here and now to have like only a glass, you know, yeah. it's super cool. Yeah. Look at that floor. Yeah, that's original as well. Beautiful. A beautiful floor, yeah, yeah, yeah. So here's the, our kids' room. Yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a kids' room. So we did it here. There was a door, door before that goes to the bathroom. Yeah. No doors as well here in this bedroom. Right? Great. Yeah, yeah, it's very, very interesting. She loves it. She loves it. She loves oh, it. Is, is the puzzle in here? The Tangram yeah. puzzle? Yeah. yeah. I can show you. There's like pieces. You can... Do a lot of shapes, a bit. Do a lot like of. But, uh, but 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 I think that the whole meaning of the I, I, I might be wrong, but the whole meaning of the tangram is like you need to do a proper square with the with those pieces, you know. So it's it's not that easy, you know. Like uh, I don't, I'm not gonna be able to do. It. <laughs> <laughs> too much yeah. pressure. Yeah. Too much but pressure. Need, a square, yeah. but you're, you're getting but, a house here. Yeah, yeah, very much. <laughs> but it's nice, like, cause yeah, you do like a palace, a penguin, you know. So it's, Right, and so the house, to compare it, the house to this. Yeah. We are, here's the, is the living room, and then mm -hmm. here's our bedroom. You have no doors, but the, the, the way that they position these blocks kind of give us privacy. Right, That's why they name, other... I think, Tengram, because of the blocks that they have around. And the blocks do, do, uh, do their magic in terms of like giving us privacy. Yeah. <laughs> and this is really cool. Like two, two hour oh, room. I mean, this, we can oh, wow. fly. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. That's we only you know, like that. We we ask it for it, right? True. Because we you know, if we go, I mean, if you look that way, you can see, you know, the living room and stuff. And when we are on the opposite way, when we are in the living room and we see this side of the house, if you close it, you think that the house is done, you know. Right. Oh my gosh, I had no idea. No, and the, and look how it's positioned. And when we saw it, we we thought. But is it is there a door here? Maybe the door is coming from here, or you know, yeah. it was weird. And yeah, it's yeah. perfect. I yeah, mean, nice, nice. hi. Oh, so here was here where I think was like four rooms or something, and they transform in our room. You know, so yeah. There here is. I don't know where to begin. Yeah. Right. I mean, like it's. I'm. I'm walking up. Does it see through? Okay. <laughs> all, yeah. Oh yeah. So, okay. Hi. Right, here we go. <laughs> okay. So this. Uh, it's the color coding, right? When we. I mean, this the, the green wall. So when people come here and they need to find it, the the bathroom is the, this big green wall, and if you come around, for this way, you know this like this area, the bath. Yeah. No, this is like great. I mean, wow. it's, crazy. it feels actually this, you feel like you're outside kind of like with the reflection of the light and the plant. So he, here was a, um, a bedroom before. And the original bathroom used to be just where the shower is. The whole bathroom was, was only, was the shower. It was so small. And they kind of, uh, they kind of uh, hide the, 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 you know, like oh my gosh, the, yeah, yeah, the butter. Yeah. Wow, that was a surprise. <laughs> so yeah, it was like in the beginning we didn't know. So yeah, where's the where's the what is how do you say really? that the toilet? Correct. So it's here. So you yeah. open here. And, uh, very nice. Very right? wow. And actually, they did a very good job also in in terms of like uh, the the cuts, uh, the cuts and stuff. So it's very uh, seamless cuts. So it's very beautiful. Uh, we love it. Definitely cool. didn't see that one coming. You're right? <laughs> Super cool. We, we this are... is a panic room. Yeah, a panic room, panic room, right? <laughs> yeah, we can hide here. Yeah. yeah, this is like a. The, these tiles are are handmade, so there's not typical tiles that are 
like a block and then they come cutting it you know so there's the made it one in one and uh, even in the box they say like i try to mix it because the colors are different and yeah. gives it like this uh gradient light i don't know that this no effect yeah. and here we have like we can see outside yeah, yeah. and actually we the tiles are like from, from here oh. like it's made in, in Bordeaux, you know so it's like it's like an open shower. It's an open shower. Although we want to close in here and, and and do a little sauna, but it's an open shower. Yeah. A sauna must be nice. Yeah. yeah, yeah. No, it's but it's fine because it's on a little platform, so it. Yeah, no, it, it, it rolls off down. Yeah, pretty much. It's a very big. Yeah, it's huge, and I love the different color. Yeah, I love it. So neat that it's like yeah. this glowing object there, right? and it's nice because we don't like much light at night so the the yellow gives like a natural light and yeah. because you know you have a light there and yeah. this all this lighting in the the wall i think was perfectly chose because it's i mean oh, yeah. it's super diffuse you know yeah the shower is always like a beautiful yeah. and then here like a, even with the with the claws and the stuff they did these sort of forms there's no corners no proper corners yeah because you, know? you know if if we're here I mean, if I'm changing here, there's no no way people are, can see me. That's because of the way this these blocks are put in. Yeah, this is this is almost a tangram piece, right? Yeah. For example, like that was a room. Here was a room, and that was another room. There was a wall here. There was a wall here. So instead of removing, they just put left the the wall here in the middle, and just put claws in this side and claws in this side. So the the wall is still here. And it yeah. almost looks like a real life tangram type of thing correct as bella mentioned in the beginning i think there was there was another door in the project because of there wasn't because we we could even keep our our privacy without that door i mean it's nice to have one door at least <laughs> because we didn't have any you know before so it was perfect place even the furniture is a, a sort of a series of triangles, right? And, and angles like that, right? And yeah, like, <laughs> and there's like the drawers, you know? See, like now that you saw the Tangram game, that's pretty much a piece, right? It's another piece of the Tangram. Yeah. Doesn't feel like a bedroom. This, I don't even know what to call this because it's like this series of hallways and a maze, a maze bedroom. Yeah. But it makes it feel so much bigger, actually, because you, you don't see all of it at once. So you keep finding more. Correct. It doesn't feel like a bedroom. It's like sort of a space or... or a little forest or something, you know? Yeah, it's amazing. Do you close the door much? Only when we have people over, then we yeah. close. Just to say like uh, the house end here. It seems that the house is done. See, now we get like a proper... Perfect. Privacy, you know, See. like in this whole area. Yeah. Normally, when when and now that you ask us, hi, if we close the door, when we are, when there's people there and we are taking shower and stuff, yeah, yeah, yeah. I and mean, because we can hear it, and it's so big, you know. Sometimes we're tired from the ward, you know, like need to yeah. be alone for a little bit. <laughs> and we never thought about having a toilet inside. It. I mean, it's super different. Yeah, it I is, love it. It's super creative. Mm -hmm. yeah. We have a little light there. Oh yeah, it's nice. It's all white, continuous, right? Like, mm. yeah. See, so we removed the the um, the tiles, yeah. The tiles from the, because we needed two other spaces. Here, so, so, you know? Yeah. yeah, for example, here you can see like underneath the bed as well. There was like proper tiles we had to remove because. For example, here, there, the door. remember there, were, there was a wall here that I told you? So yeah, the wall. You see, they're like different colors. And they're like, even they needed to twist a bit because it was from one room to another. So they did a kind of a great job. But if you focus it, you see that it's like after, yeah. you know? Yeah. But anyways, yeah. Should we go upstairs for you to have a look? Sure. Yeah. It's hard to keep these white. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of light here. There was a doctor that used to live here, so they had like a bunch of books. And then we kept it, and this is our working area. The shelves are great. It's the only thing that's not white. Correct. We almost painted, but then we said, yeah, no, let's, let's leave it. It's original. So, so you, you work much at home? We are both, both at home. Right? You work from home. Oh, nice. Uh, yeah, this space was like, a, as I said, we, the guy was a doctor here, so he had like a lot of 
documents of because he, back in the days they didn't have like computers and stuff so he kept like all the files of his patients oh like God. and then we turn it into like a sort of a studio thing you know like a oh, cool. yeah. like a playroom yeah, yeah. yeah oh wow oh it keeps going look at the roof yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> this is where you see the roof too yeah. true correct my gosh so the the, the architect original architect just did not believe in straight lines like <laughs> you're right i mean yeah, that's right. Yeah, here you can see what, how the roof is. Like, if you go outside, when we go outside, you will see like a, these shapes. But that's like inside of the roof. It was actually, it's not a, it's not a livable area. We just okay. turn into it. And it used yeah. to be like a trastero, you know, like a, like a, a place just to hide and stuff. Storage, right? Yeah. Super nice. It's a trastero, but it works again. See, like, yeah, come on, right? This, this is what I'm talking about. Like, even here, like, they did like proper. You know, like all the lines, see, come on. You, you don't do this type of work nowadays if you know that it's a trastero here. Look at that little corner there. Yeah. And that was like completely original. This we didn't do paint. anything here, just painted. We just painted. And see, that's what I meant, like the quality of the, the, the guys that built this in the first place in the 70s, you know, like they really put in some really good work. So yeah, in this space here, we, we, oh, wow. we used to, because they're like a bedroom here, a bed here, a bed there, pretty much a lot of beds. And a lot of guitars and, yeah. and amplifiers and like, yeah. yeah. Do you play? Yeah, I do play. Yeah, yeah. Bit, yeah. The sound must be interesting, bouncing a bit with the different angles. Yeah, no? I, How does, does surprisingly it... no. not that okay. much, huh? Okay. Oh. Yeah. It, wow. it, and the sound is good, right? You thought there was going to be bouncing. It's not that bad. Yeah. Not that bad. You can have concerts up here. Yeah. And see the project right here. Oh, uh, yeah. The document. Yeah, yeah, the, um, the house. See? What, what they presented us. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this is... oh, yeah. See the yeah. shapes. Oh, the yeah. shapes. It looks just like what you had on the floor. Yeah, yeah. exactly. See, what those are. So the kitchen is here. Oh, here. Okay. Yeah. So our bedroom is here. You see like uh, the toilet mm -hmm. when, when the toilet's inside. So that's what I mentioned about the Tangran pieces and stuff. Yeah. See? yeah. It's amazing. Like studying this. the map, they saw all the geometric figures. Hexagonos, octagonos, no? Irregulares. The shapes that they, they found in the... Este es, este es mobiliario nuestro, por ejemplo. Estas baldosas hidráulicas recuperadas de de Barcelona. Que también parece un tangram, un puzzle. Un... Sí, sí, porque ¿No? aparte hay algunas que se pueden mover. Ah. No, hay unas piezas. No todos, pero... ¡Ah, oh, qué bien! O sea, es una mesa que tú puedes hacerle el dibujo que quieras. ¡Qué bien! ¡Me encanta! Y son mesas, son centenarias todas, son de, de, de la Plaza Letamendi de Barcelona, de un edificio de 1900. Y esta casa, que era una casa hexagonal, pues, pues le venía perfecto. Ha vuelto a entrar. Oli, mira, mira. Pero ¿por qué no hay más, más de esto de casas que no son tan tan cuadradas? Ya. Yeah. <risa> Para empezar hay que entenderlas. Y allá, al final los espacios están concebidos o el mobiliario está concebido para 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 espacios rectangulares o cuadrados, ¿no? Sí. Y esto es lo que cuesta. Por ejemplo, aquí tú no pones un sofá, no lo puedes poner. O lo haces en obra, o lo haces a medida, o no puedes hacerlo de una forma cómoda. Ya, yeah, supongo que eh, sí. ¿Cómo es más difícil también, no, de hacerlo así? O... Es más difícil, sí, por, a, a un nivel de... Eh, es un laberinto, está abierto. <risa> sí, exacto. Es... es más difícil a nivel tanto constructivo porque las cosas ya no son estándar, sino que empiezan a ser a medida, a nivel de coste, tiene esta cosa, pero claro, lo, lo que te ofrece a cambio también es mucho mejor. Yeah. Diego Isabela, es que es medio proyecto es, es suyo, de entenderlo todo. Y disfrutarlo, sobre todo disfrutarlo, que es como una parte súper importante en arquitectura, saber disfrutar. Sí. Um.